Does Netflix One Piece have an Alvita problem? If you don't know anything about Alvita, she's one of the first main enemies for Luffy in the manga and of course the anime as well. And that's where Luffy eventually meets Kobe, who develop a friendship and of course become on opposing sides of a war between the pirates and the world government. And of course, this is something that we all know about Alvita. She's just a, a big, larger than life villain character that we've seen in the Netflix live action adaptation. She has such a great personality. I think the actress does a great job of presenting her in this live action adaptation. But of course, there's a problem here with Alvita. If you know her future arcs within the story of One Piece, because she has a focus on her weight when you come to know her in One Piece. She has a phrase that is popular in One Piece where she says, who's the most beautiful of them all of course they change this to who's the most powerful of them all which i'm fine with that change it's okay i think it's still in line with the character but i think she is a, a character that has a pivotal role at least in log town and i think she may have even more of a pivotal role going in the future with a uh, buggy so i'm thinking how will they present her where she has a, a thinning figure in future episodes meaning she's not as big and voluptuous as she is in her initial stage and of course if you take into consideration modern politics when it comes to the development of these adaptations which is something all hollywood studios do nowadays they usually would not refuse or they would frown upon thinning a, a bigger actress uh, for the role or even replacing a, a big actress for a thinner actress even if it's comic accurate even if it's a direct adaptation from the comic books manga or anime i think that is a problem that is developing at netflix because i think the actress is doing great i think she she does a great job as alvita but how do you approach this change in the story that is about to happen with alvita where she does become thinner and i think it's part of her character it's not some random thing that doesn't matter to the story it applies to the story it makes sense and i think it's it's something that you can't really change and if they do change it would it be receptive by the fans because it will be a critical change they make and I, I think there's two ways they can go about this for me the main thing I would do is just focus on maybe getting the actress skinnier I think that is the best option because the actress is already talented enough I think she does a good job as Alvita so I don't see any reason to recast her I think you just ask her to slim down and this is something actors and actresses are always asked for their roles we've seen christian bell as someone obese as someone anorexic someone as a healthy muscular man we see a lot of actors go through weight changes and i think this is a weight change you should be able to ask an actress even if they're a female actress i know people are going to be sensitive to female weight gain and loss but i think if you want if you want to be one of the best actors you have to do those things to, to get those achievements and i think she should be asked to lose weight and i think there's no problem with it because it applies to the character and it shows her dedication to the craft i think that's uh the, the most simplest way to go about it and of course the most complex way and uh, the most controversial way is just to recast her and that's something i think they should have the right to do if she isn't willing to do her job and uh reflect the, the characters uh, on the page the story shouldn't move around an actor that is kind of insignificant in hollywood so i don't know why would you move around the story for them if they don't fit in the role get them out of there i think we need this cutthroat in we need this cutthroat part of hollywood back just to, to get the stories in line if actors don't want to be part of the role anymore because they have some uh, philosophical differences between the creatives and i think they should be able to be recasted and i think that's something a lot of these studios have forgotten they have the power to do or they don't wish to do it anymore because they don't want to be seen as evil or insensitive on social media so i think for the most part those are your two options to deal with this alvita problem i think for the most part they will probably go with just asking her to lose weight i think that is the simplest solution a solution that i think she's already adhering to if you do see her because some of her new instagram posts she seems significantly more thinner and these are recent too these are a few weeks ago so she looks a lot thinner than she did in the past i think she probably is preparing for the future role as alvita of course 
This is uh, during a SAG after a strike. We don't know when that strike is going to end, but she probably already has an idea that her role is coming back and maybe she can fit into that role by just losing weight. And I think that is uh, a thing I think she can do. I think she's a pretty actress. So if she loses the weight, I think she'll fit that model of Alveda who becomes significantly more prettier in the, the later versions. As you, as you can see, she's thinner in the animation after eating a devil fruit. And I think she has a pretty enough face where I think she can match the thinner version. So I think she has that that advantage right there. So I think if she does do that, she'll, she'll be, still be a perfect fit for the role. I think uh, she's already a perfect fit for the bigger version of Alveda. And I think she'll be an even better fit for the thinner Alveda. I think that is a big advantage that a lot of people can't say they have. And I think that is a, a big plus for her. It seems like she's already put in the work. So maybe this is not really that big of a problem, but what do you think about uh, creatives and executives at uh, the production of a film asking their actors to lose weight? I think this is something that usually was calming in Hollywood. We see actors do it by their own volition sometimes when it comes to Christian Bale. He's the extreme example. We see it happen with all these other Oscar winners. Matthew McConaughey, he did it for uh, Dallas ba Buyers Club. He won an Oscar. So it seems like this is something that is not asked of female actresses. And I think, of course, their career is a, a very different entity than a male actor's career because a male can go in, into old age getting a lot of roles where a female actress, her roles are limited as she grows older. So I can see uh, them gaining weight and maybe destroying their figure may limit their future roles. So it's a, a different dynamic there where I see okay, you can't really ask them to, to gain weight. And I think that will hurt their career if you do ask a female actress. So I understand the double standards. And double standards are true and they're there for a reason. So I wouldn't ask the, the, a female actress to gain weight. But I think you should be willing to lose weight, at least for your role, and at least for your job and secure income, and if not for your own health. So for me, I think this is where, uh, okay, you shouldn't ask an actress to gain weight, but you should be able to ask her to lose weight. And I think that's a fair compromise uh, there. And I think that will solve the Alveda problem, but it may create some other problems, at least for me. I know people may be mad at me suggesting that she, she lose weight for a role, but I'm thinking this is just a job. You have to do what the job asks for. And I think she may be already doing that. So maybe my complaints are null and void and don't matter at all, but One Piece may just keep her big. And I think that is a, another option that may happen just with the, the cultural sensitivity around weight gain and, and just unhealthy weight for individuals in America. So I think that is something that is a, a prospect of happening. That's why I consider this a problem because I think it's, it's a significant part of the story, her weight and just her, her figure. So I don't see how you change that. And if they do, they better have a good excuse why. But you tell me, what do you think they're going to do with this Alveda situation? Are you thinking you're going to ask her to lose weight, recast her, or just keep her big? Leave your thoughts, comments, like, share, and subscribe. This is Wagner Knows Why. Catch you next time.